More than 500 Syrians, including 151 children, have died after two weeks of government airstrikes in Aleppo. That's according to the British-based Syrian Observatory for Human Rights. 25 people were killed on Saturday when barrels packed with explosives were dropped on a crowded market. Rebel-held areas in Aleppo have been targeted by an aerial campaign by government forces since December 15. Government troops are dropping barrel bombs, oil drums or barrels filled with explosives and shrapnel. Anti-government forces say people are being massacred, but government troops say they're targeting terrorists. More than 120,000 people have been killed in Syria since 2011. Over 2.3 million have fled to neighboring countries such as Lebanon and Jordan. Representatives from the two sides and the United States, Russia and the United Nations are scheduled to meet in Switzerland next month to seek ways to end the war. Parts of Aleppo are under rebel control. The government says it's targeting terrorists. Meanwhile, Syrian President Bashar al-Assad has sent a private message to Pope Francis. The pontiff has made several appeals for an end to the violence that has claimed an estimated 100,000 lives since March 2011. In his Christmas Day address in St. Peter's Square, Pope Francis called for humanitarian aid access in Syria. The main Syrian opposition group, the National Coalition, says it won't take part in peace talks due to take place in Geneva next month if the airstrikes continue.